Two more deadly events have been reported in Germany since Sunday, adding to the string of events that have disrupted Germany over the past week. Meanwhile, there are new developments in the investigation into the shooting rampage in Munich last Friday and the blast in Ansbach on Sunday. Peng Ojun has the latest. A 27-year-old Syrian asylum seeker killed himself and injured 12 others after setting off a bomb outside an open-air music festival in the city of Ansbach near Nuremberg on Sunday. The BBC reports citing the Bavarian interior minister that the man set off the blast after he was refused entry into the festival. It's the third attack in the state of Bavaria in a week, following the shooting rampage in Munich on Friday and the axe attack on a train on Tuesday. It is also the third major act of violence carried out by migrants in a week after a 21-year-old Syrian migrant killed a woman with a machete in Hoytlingen near Stuttgart on Sunday, which local authorities are investigating as a crime of passion. After what just happened in Munich and today in Rutlingen, all the things you hear about, it's very disturbing when you know that such things can happen so close to you. Meanwhile, the Munich police have arrested a 16-year-old Afghan friend of David Ali Stonboli, the 18-year-old German-Iranian gunman who killed nine people at a Munich shopping center on Friday. According to a police statement, the 16-year-old has been detained on suspicion of being a possible tacit accomplice for knowing about the planned attack but failing to report it. Hong Wojun, Arirang News.